What's going on everybody, it's TVG Hydreigon here with another Pokemon Uranium video. And I mean like, if you've forgotten what happened last time, I don't blame you, cause I kinda do too. If my memory bank is working properly, uh, Cameron, Theo's dad, is not dead, and we've started a cutscene. Right, so, Theo's dad ain't dead, and it turns out he's just some sort of like super the uh, hero kind of dude with a pseudo legendary Pokemon too and we're off to hunt Urain and the legendary Pokemon I forgot its name I think it was it Urain no whoa 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 okay so obviously past me had no idea what he was talking about so just for clarification Urain, Urain is the giant Pokemon while Kiri is the trainer Oh, who cares? Right, we're going off to go find them and fight them. So, here we got Theo. Good, I think everyone's here. You ready to go, Inferno? We're going into the hazard zone. It's gonna be pretty dangerous. Plus, they'll be swarming with nuclear Pokemon. But I'm not afraid. I can handle a few nuclears, no problem. How about you? Already set out? Alright, um... Voila, we're making actual progress for the first time in a couple of months. Well, it's been a couple of months for me. It's probably been, like, a month for you guys. <laughs> I, I actually don't know when I uploaded last, but still, it's been a couple of months. Kirsch, this is Kellen to Hazard Team 1. Do you copy? Loud and clear, sir. We're on route to the Hazard Zone right now. Are Inferno and Theo there with you? Yeah. Inferno and me are, uh, I mean, yes, sir. Good. You will need to equip yourselves for the mission. In the boat storage case, you will find packs of Pokeballs. These are new experimental types of balls that our researchers have developed. They should work especially well on nuclear balls. <gasps> oh, it's like beast balls, but for nuclear Pokemon. Now there's one more piece of technology that you'll need. The crowning jewel of all our research, the hazard suit. Whoa, that, that looks weird. As you can see, this is just a prototype. Right now, there is only one functional suit. The rest of your mission will be equipped with gas masks and radiation shielding clothing. But the hazard suit is something special. We base it on blueprints developed in the Hoenn region. It will completely shield your body from the radioactive fallout. Great, it's like the magma or aqua suit from, you know, Ruby and Sapphire. Inferno, I want you to wear it. I could have worn it myself, but circumstances being what they are, I trust that you will make good use of it. No, I wanted to wear the suit, but I know why you picked you, Inferno. You're the better trainer between us. Inferno, I don't, I don't doubt you'll make me proud. Now everyone, your mission is infiltrate the power plant and find where Curie is hiding. Subdue them and separate them from the legendary Pokemon Uranus so that they both can be brought into custody. This is real. The fate of the region is at stake. You are Tandor's best and brightest. We are all counting on you. Good luck out there. Over and out. Oh, yikes. Okay, do I, do I put on the suit right now? Oh. Oh my god, look at me. I look like I'm ready for snow or something. We're headed to Route 8, the wheat fields. It used to be a pristine area of natural beauty. Now it's the most irradiated place in Tandor. We've gotta stop Kiri and make them pay for what they've done. Theo, any last words? Man, that hazard suit is freaking sweet, but the gas masks are cool too, I guess. Anyways, we can't afford to waste time. Let's go. Right, so, just a quick update on my team. I, I did train a little bit. So it was very annoying I have to just like bike all around Tandor. We have Winter, level 54, Gina 53, Marvin 55, Festus 56, Cassie 55, and Clark 53. The only Pokemon that I am not as scared for is Marvin because he's part steel type. Everyone else is four times weak to nuclear. And that just scares the hell out of me. Oh, the air is thick here. I don't think we could breathe without these masks. This is Kellen. In Inferno, Theo, do you copy? We hear you, boss. We've entered the hazard zone. Alright, your target is a power plant to the northwest. You should start making your way there now. Be on your guard. It's likely you will be attacked by nuclear Pokemon. My rangers will flank you to keep you safe. Got it. Got it. Good luck. Inferno, let's hurry to the entrance of the power plant. I'm gonna get there first. Uh, well, alright. Okay. Uh, oh, damn, an Arbok. Ah, calm down, damn it. What? Hey, these new capture starters work. I can handle myself out here. Inferno, you should head out to the power plant. Oh, that's great. These guys have got it under control. Ooh, Bash Shaft. 
kind of worried, kind of, very, very worried. I'm very worried. I'm gonna go into Marvin. Oh, Jesus Christ, nuclear slash. Okay. That's good. That would have honestly probably have killed Winter, if not super low HP. Okay, shoot. The thing is, Bashaf normally is dark fighting type. If I remember correctly, I think the primary typing was dark. So, uh, Thunderbolt is the only super effective move I've got against it. And it seems like it works? Hell yeah. Oh, another Pokemon. Shoot. Arbok. Oh, dear god. Okay. Arbok is a poison type, which means... I don't... I don't, I don't want to go into grass anymore. Oh, no! A Bariat! Oh, my Tauros could have evolved into that. Oh, I risk it all for such a small biscuit. Oh. Mm, so close. I shard, I shard his priority. Yes! Mm. Let's go, Winter. 1800 experience for you. Good job. Alright, look, it's Theo. Hey, Inferno. There you are. Heh. You look like a slowpoke in that thing. But you look pretty cool, I gotta admit. Anyways, I think I spotted something cool. Follow me, but keep quiet. Hey, Theo, what is it? That Pokemon. Have you ever seen it before? It doesn't seem like the other nuclear types. I've never seen anything like it. Should we try to... Oh, I, I think it no- Oh my god, it's like a tiny baby Godzilla! Maybe. Crap, it ran away. What scared it off? I was trying to catch it. Get ready to fight in front of- Oh, damn. Okay, we've encountered a horde. A nuclear horde appeared. Yo! That's pretty sick! I'm going into Marvin. I should have healed. Oh, but it's, it's cool, it's cool, it's what it's it's whatever, I guess. Hey! Hey, that's pretty good. Free experience for winter? I, I don't mind that, I don't... Winter... Winter's level 55. Yes! Oh! Oh! Time skill use nuclear slash on a normal flying type. Oh. Oh, dear! Oh, I really should have kept, I don't know, like, Diggy or Harry. At least they were, like, single types. Or I could have even had Raffaella, who, uh, water steel. Like, and maybe we replace Cassie. Yo, Nucleon. His evolution looks kind of nice, though. I'm gonna recover. I'm gonna thunder. I'm gonna thunderbolt. Hey, hey, oh, that's great. This AI is kind of smart, cause Hero Loon it's four times effective. Die. And Thunderbolt. That Tanskier is gone. Thank you. Oh, that's it. <laughs> yes. Winter's evolving. Wait, no. I have to open a Photoshop now. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> Oh, winter's evolving. That's great. Oh, look at that beauty of Fafninter. Oh, man, you can't even let your guard down for a second out here. Also, was it just me or were those nuclear types more organized than usual? I guess Jurain must be commanding them. So they know we're here. We've lost the element of surprise. Well, it doesn't matter. Curie can't run from us forever. Let's go and get him. And if I see that strange Pokemon again, I won't hesitate to catch it. Attaboy, Theo. Now, let's take a look. See, look at that. Fafninter. That looks beautiful. Attack, special attack. Thick fat resistant to fire and ice types. Aren't you a dragon? Oh. Oh, that's great. That's so cool. All right, I just gave Winter the Ice Shard, and we're gonna... We're actually gonna lead with Jean, just so she could get a bit of experience, maybe. 
Oh, that's a fat yikes. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to just fight them? I don't like this. Oh god. Grr, intruder, intruder. Okay, great. Another wild boar. Oh. Brand and Tanskir. Okay. If Gene is fast enough, which I sincerely hope so. She could take out the brand. Yes! Okay. Brand is gone. You can one hit KO. Let's go. That's what I like to see. That's fine. That's fine by me. Just everyone gain a bit of experience. Good job. That was it. That was it. That was it. That was it. Okay. The nuclear horde's gone. I can now heal. I I'm gonna have to leave with Marvin. I I just don't want to risk having anyone die. Okay. And now we encounter our next horde. Okay, okay, Bariette, that's not good. I think Bariette's slower than, way slower than Tasker. So Marvin's Psychic, see Arbok, and Clark Green punches the Bariette. Yes! Super effective, great, 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 great. Okay, another Arbok, and another Bariette. Another Psychic, another Drain Punch. Okay, Clark's 54, Clark is Dynamic Punch. Oh my god. 75, 100, but 50% accuracy. I just can't do that. No, that's way too risky of a move to take. Alright, Marvin, 57. Trying to learn Dark Pulse. That, pretty good move. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna forget Shadow Ball. Oh, okay. Nuclear Horde defeated. I'm gonna pause recording for a bit, and I'm just gonna train up for a while here. See if I could get everyone up a level or two. Eleven minutes later. Amazing! I found a shiny tan skewer while training. Now, I'm training up Hephaestus, the last Pokemon. Look at that, level 59. I'm gonna get him to almost 40. But this is a shiny. And that is one sick combination of colors. And also tan- and also, you know, tan skewers just literally die at everything. What do I do? Uh, well, it's a nuclear, so I'm just gonna go into Marvin if I'm gonna take more than one turn with it. Nuclear slash? Well, crap, that kind of sucks. I think it's dark nuclear. Well, hey! Okay, okay, okay. I really hope it doesn't die to this. Come on, don't- land a crit. You can flinch it. Yes! I think we just got ourselves a nuclear chance here. Do I have Pokeballs? What the hell? Oh wait, I have 20 nuclear balls. Oh, come on. One, two, three. Yes! Oh! Shiny claws and all. Uh, I don't know. It's red. It's black. It's. I'm just gonna name it Logan. He looks angry. And less than five minutes later, I am done training. Our team leveled up, everyone is 56 and higher. And they learned a great new strategy against these nuclear Pokemon. It doesn't matter who I send out. I just have to kill it in one single shot. That, that, usually, that usually works really well. And after having taken the most optimal route, I think... Alright, here we go. Yeah, this is... it's, it's time, it's time. I know I said that the only strategy I have is to kill in one hit, but I'm still really freaking scared. Inferno, look! It's that Pokemon again! Who? Oh, the weird little baby Godzilla thing. It looks like it went between those trees. I'm gonna follow it. Hey, is that the... Are, are, are you stupid? What, what's up here? Ah, uh, okay. I need to follow Theo to the groove, I guess. Groove? Grove? This place. Is it just me, or is the air different in here? Inferno, what does the Geiger counter on your suit tell you? I don't believe it. There's no radiation here at all. Oh, I can breathe in here without the mask. How is this possible? Inferno, do you know what this means? Something has purged the radiation here. And I think I know what did it. Let's head further inside. Oh my god, there's a ton of little baby Godzillas. There it is, and there's more than one of them too. Inferno, I'm gonna catch one now, alright? You should catch one for yourself, too. 
Uh, what happens? Oh my god, they're all tiny. Great, so I guess uh, we just grab ourselves a little Godzilla. Um, we'll go with this one. Has. Ah, <gasps> oh, new Pokemon. This is a static encounter. So, we should be able to catch it. Hazma. Oh my god, he's in a little hazmat suit. Shit, I think he might be nuclear. Okay, I'm gonna go into Gene. Now, we Leech Seed. Just in case he uses a nuclear move, we could get a little bit of a HP back. And this means we've only got eight turns to use. Come on, as long... Okay, oh, it has recovered. As recovered, that's great news. Now, I want to go into Winter and Ice Shark because that is the weakest move we've got. But Hazma is a nuclear type after all, and I don't know if that's a good idea. All right, let's see. So we've already feather danced it all the way down. Its attack is completely gone. Okay, let's see. So Ice Shark is 40 and that's still fairly strong. So I'm going to... I mean, we have 19 nuclear bolts. We, we, we've got a shot, right? Oh? Aw, oh, dude, that was... That was so close. It has recovered. It has recovered. So, I'll be going into... Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna ice shard. Oh! Yo! Look at that! Oh, it's so little HP. That's great, 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 great. This is amazing. Alright, it's in the ball. One, two, three. Oh. Uh-oh. Okay, please. Either recover or get in the ball. Because you're gonna die, and I really don't want that. No! Come on, recover, recover. Oh, thank you, thank you. Okay. Please, just stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. <laughs> Yes! Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Hazma. Hazma, the overcoat Pokemon. They appear in the aftermath of nuclear fallout. They feed on radiation and can clean an irradiated area over time. That is amazing. Okay, nickname to Hazma. And so he shall be baptized before the Lord. Toxisaur. Hey, there we go. Alright, we've got him. We've got our little boy, Toxasaur. He's adorable. And everyone gets a little bit of experience. Great. Now what? Theo? That's incredible, Inferno. We gotta tell Kellen about this. This is This is Kellen. Is something the matter? No, but we've discovered something amazing. You're not gonna believe this, boss. Well, go on. Oh, um, it's a Pokemon. A new kind of Pokemon. It's a nuclear type, but it isn't hostile. It's not even radioactive. This is just a guess, but I think it eats radiation. We're in this area inside the hazard zone, and it's completely clean. I don't even need to wear my mask in here. Theo, that's dangerous. Put your mask on back on right now. Even if you don't see any evidence, it might still be radioactive. I promise it isn't. We checked with the Geiger counter on the hazard suit. It's totally radiation-free. It's bizarre. If what you're saying is true, then this could completely change your strategy. Excellent work, Theo. Inferno, keep me posted on any new discoveries you make. But remember, your primary goal remains the same. If we don't stop Curie, we can't begin the restoration process. Your geolocators say you are not far from the power plant right now. It's due north. Curie is there. Find them and end this once and for all, for Tandor. Your dad sure knows how to stay focused on a singular goal, but he's right. It's cool we discovered this, but we still got a bitter, bigger fresh to fry. Let's get moving. Okay, good guy. Right, so long, little guys. I hope you don't mind that I uh, abducted your friend, but I don't care. He's adorable. He's mine now. All right, let's see. Oh, gee, more Pokemon. Let's do this, Inferno. Oh, dear God. Are those... No, it's another horde. Tropinth and bury it. Who's out front? Hephaestus. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this. I can earthquake those two. Okay. I mean, 
Splendifel, flying type, right? Who cares about Earthquake? Everyone else is just super effective against, so... Tropheim, that's one. That's one, that's good. Okay, okay. It doesn't affect Splendifel. And let's see how it does against Barry yet. Oh, close, close. Hey, Hurricane! That's it, it's dead, it's dead now. Okay, if it worked the first time, it's gotta work again. Alright, Tanskier. Oh, that one's gone. That means Tropheim has to be dead as well. Doesn't affect Splendifel. And Tropheim is gone. Yes! Alright, we're doing good. If us is just, just beating the absolute hell out of everyone. One more Earthquake, right? Get Barriott down low, and possibly knock out the Tanskier. Ayo, 61. Please don't nuclear slash me. See, this is why I don't want you using Hurricane Theo. It misses and it scares me. Well, that was eventful. Our orders are clear. It's time to go to the power plant. Let's do this together. <gasps> Theo, you joined me. Yes. Okay, well, I mean, I don't know if everyone actually healed. Oh my god. Theo, I really don't want to do this right now. Ayo, okay, so. Hephaestus, I love him, but I do think it's a bit of a weakness to have him up front. Ah, oh, man. Okay, what, what, who, who, who cares? He's our strongest. He's my strongest Pokemon. He can Mega Evolve. You can take on these guys. Destroy, destroy, destroy. All right, there we go. All right, a nuclear horde. And I mean, once again, Theo's probably leading with Splendifel. That's great. The Pokemon are level 55. I'm going to Mega Evolve and Earthquake. Should take out the Arbok, 100%. As for Tanskier, ah. All right, Tanskier, gone. Another Tanskier, another Tanskier, I'm not going to be able to knock either of these out. Well, that's fine, we just Earthquake them. If we're lucky, this will land to crit. We weren't lucky. Nuclear Slash, uh oh. Now, Splendifowl might be dead. Oh my god, okay, Splendifowl is gone. Uh oh, come on, have this buddy, please. Come on, you, you, you Mega Evolved. Oh my god, yes! Okay, Theo, no hard feelings, but I don't care about your Pokemon, so I am going to... I'm gonna Earthquake everyone. Who cares? They're both gone. That's all that matters. Okay, ooh, ooh, ooh! If they don't have Sudden Strike, we should be good. Yes! That's it, that's it, that's it. Those Arbok are gone. You're totally dead. Alright, let's continue on here. We're at the power plant. <sighs> the air is hard to breathe here. Slow down just, just a little, okay? You can't breathe as well as you can in that suit. I don't think Zio's gonna be able to come with us. We're here. Fury is in there. And I'm willing to bet they already know we're coming. Have you arrived at the power plant? Yeah. We're here. Man, this place is a total wreck. I'm willing to bet it's infested with nuclear Pokemon too, but it's no match for us. Not so fast, Theo. You won't be entering the power plant with Inferno. I need you to return to the boat. What? You can't be serious. Inferno and me, we're gonna take down Kiri together. I'm an awesome trainer, I can do it too. Now is not the time, Theo. Our scanners are detecting extreme levels of radiation within. Inferno is the only one that can withstand them in the hazard suit. You've done your job, protecting Inferno up until this point. Now, I need you to t fall back and leave the rest up to them. That's an order from your chief. I don't want to leave Inferno behind. Are you sure about this? What if... What if Inferno doesn't come back? I can't just leave them here, I refuse. Theo, you are disobeying direct orders from your chief. I need you to leave the hazard zone immediately. Or do you want to end up in the same situation as your father? I have to do this. For Inferno. For my dad. I just have to... I have just as much stake in stopping Kiri as you do. Why are you sending Inferno into this all alone? Let me go with them. Theo, you don't understand. 
Your radiation protection won't be enough for you in there. Inferno is the only one who can survive it in a hazard suit. You can't get overexposed. Your life could be... Huh? Kellen? Chief, do you copy? What was that? Did something just knock out our radio? I'm not receiving a signal. Warning! Radiation levels rising. Warning! That noise just now. Was that the hazard suit? It can talk? Inferno, we need to get out of here now. Oh, oh, god damn. Looks like Urane found us. It's Urane! Huh. Holy shit! Inferno, look out! Oh, god damn. Did you just get zapped to hell? Where am I? Rebooting vital support. Support systems online. Rebooting interface. Interface online. Hello, Inferno. This is your hazard suit interface. Function, preservation of life. Performing health diagnostic. Blood toxicity, healthy. Injuries, minimal. Shit, what happened to Theo? Rebooting navigator. Reboot failed. Rebooting comm. Reboot failed. Hazard suit status. Power, low. Radiation shielding, 20% of power cell is needed. I have to find Theo. Mission objective, subdue and eliminate Curie. Deviating from mission protocol is unadvised. A power cell is needed. Once SNAVs are restored, it will turn on the tracking program. Use this to find Curie. Entering power safe mode. So nothing works without power here. We have an exit over here. Do these notes, we can't read the notes. Nah. Do we have to make a choice? Like, do we have to either go Theo or go sit or go? Oh, what the? F Flick a tofu ring. Yo, is this a is this a new area? Can we catch this thing? What do I do? What do I do? What's my weakest move? Oh, let's go into Marvin. Oh, thank God we went into Marvin. Okay, nuclear nuclear slash doesn't do that much. Okay, okay. What do I do? What do I do? If, if I Thunderbolt, that, that won't kill, right? It's not stab, and it's only two times super effective. Please, don't kill, just paralyze. Pa Shit, it didn't paralyze. This is fine. This is fine. This is all I can do. Yes! Yes! <sighs> Health orang. The cave beast Pokemon. Unable to fly or move swiftly like Tonami, Tophorang instead catch their prey by exhaling a poison gas that makes Pokemon sluggish. It's it's a nuclear one, so it's cool. I'm gonna name you Fartman. Okay. I'm gonna train up a bit more. A little bit more. You know, if S is level 62, everyone's like five, six levels behind him. And I'm just not that comfortable with that, honestly. <laughs> so, we're gonna wrap things up here for today. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed it, I don't know, leave a like, subscribe. We're getting close. We're getting close to finishing the game. But yeah, leave a like, subscribe. I don't know. <laughs> See you on the next episode.